Well, Teddy, a great team performance and an excellent 2 1 victory. Yeah, yeah, we're well, absolutely delighted. Another three points, my favourite score. Yeah, 2 1 again. 2 1 again, but no, you know, it was a really good overall performance in the end, wasn't it? After starting quite slowly, you know, we thought they were, they were okay. So it's a little bit, we didn't get a goal, but after 10 minutes or so, then we kicked on, uh, dominated in the second half. I know they scored early with their only shot on target in the whole game. Um, fair play then, it was a decent goal, I held, held it up well and played them in. But then after that, we you know, went exactly the way we thought. You know, we beat them out, get the wide areas, key positions. Uh, and, we scored, and it was great to see Louis score a couple of goals. Thoroughly deserved his, his play overall in the last few weeks has been really good anyway. He just hasn't got the chance to score, you know, I and mean, he took his two goals really well to do. And he could have gone on and got two or three, possibly four this afternoon. Yeah, yeah, yes. But delighted for him. The positive says he's got two, he's up and running. There should be many more to come. Uh, we'll go a goal down, and as you said, it was. Uh, well, I thought it was good play from the uh, opposition. What about our uh, situation defensively? Did we get caught a bit flat footed? Yeah, yeah, look at the lads held it up. He's, he's, he's done well. He's a big, strong lad, the nine. He's, he's, he's a difficult player to play against, but I, I thought we played him really well. But you now that was his one moment for the game, and, and we just got caught, caught out on the through ball. So, yeah, we'll look at it. You always look at goals and analyse them and think we'll, we want to do better. But overall, if you're going to restrict any team to about three shots, I think, in the whole game for them, one shot on target, it tells you that was defended well as well. I know you, you keep his stats, but uh, there must have been uh, quite a few in our favour, uh, shots, corners, yeah. uh, crosses. Did you, did you keep your yeah, yeah, all those? Yeah, yeah, look, it's first half, numerous. All together, we've had like 20, 28 crosses, 18 shots, 8 corners, because I always look at the attack and play a bit. So that you know, tells you there that we've, we've dominated the game. You know? But, but we, we knew, we thought, we'd watched them play, and we thought we could attack them in key areas, and it's, and it's worked out well. The lads have executed it with some really good quality attacking football, switched the play well, got into good situations and wide areas. Um, just would like to score a few more. Yeah, so you know, although you dominate and it, you know, it's that 2 1 scoreline, it only takes a worldie from, you know, from someone from 25 yards and, and they're backing you. But I thought we managed the game well, uh, second half, later stages, and uh, overall deserved the three points. Yeah, yeah, because it, it was the wind and then the rain was coming in, what faces. Uh, they, they were obviously going to have a go, try to get, you know, they were pressing us a bit more, but I thought, like you just said, we really managed the game well. We went over the press when we need to go over the press. Um, so yeah, you know the lads, like I said, to restrict any team to just one shot on target tells you that the team's really defended well. So it was a really good all-round performance. Created lots, so we're delighted with. Uh, and to restrict any team, it's good what we've done. Nitpicking, we just we want a few more goals. And on the last little phase, we'd like to score a few more. But we'll keep working at that, and I'm sure they'll come. Uh, excellent team performance, but uh, it was littered with uh, some fine individual efforts as well. I mean, the supporters uh, went for Brad Hubbard as their man of the match, but there were several more who, uh, who caught the eye this afternoon. All nines, possibly eights, nines out of ten, I thought. Yeah, that's what we just said. So the was just said in the dressing room, and that was a really top team performance. And when, it's not just the team, it's the squad. The yeah, squad's yeah. getting stronger this last week with a couple of additions that we've made. That's going to really keep everybody on the toes, uh, without a doubt. You know, Brad got he got the man of the match. And he had a really good uh, first game back with us, but there was a lot of other good performances. Yeah, without a doubt. Um, training is normal this week, and then we're off to Newcastle. That, is that a, another new one for you on the on the list? Yeah, yeah, it's a different yeah Newcastle town. Not, not, not your home town. Not my home town, but no, no. Look, it'll be a difficult game. Their results they seem to get some good results, and then uh, not so good results. But every game, every game you play in this league, are tough games. Yeah. Are tough games. We'll do our homework. We'll train hard this week and go in the game full of confidence. That's the key. You know, we're really confident at the moment. Playing more good football. Uh, I take it you're watching the World Cup, Terry. How does the coach view the uh, you know the constant four matches a day? Do you 
trying to uh, sort of copy some set piece moves, or or do you look at it as a fan, or how, how do you view that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're always looking at the game as the coach, so I'm always looking to see if there's any clever set players which you just mentioned. Um, I haven't been to see that many just because of the timings yeah. of the day, so that's the hard bit. But yeah, you're always as a coach looking for any little trends of you know how teams build, play out from the back, etc. Uh, and definitely set plays. So yeah, I've got my coach's eye on every game. But uh, a good performance this afternoon. I think it was a good advers- advertisement for the uh, Northern Premier League and uh, three good points at the end of the day. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Really good game. Good. We're a good football team. You know, you know, anybody coming to watch us, they've got to go home happy. You know, football is an entertainment game. I do think the team goes out and plays in a good style that'll entertain people. And so long may that continue. Terry, we appreciate your efforts this afternoon. Thanks very much.